Hey guys and welcome back to another new Animal Crossing video. I'm Crossing Channel and today I'll be teaching you guys how to get a whole bunch of villager photos within a short amount of time in Animal Crossing New Horizons. I've personally been doing this the past week and I can tell you guys that it works really well and I think you guys will enjoy using this one a lot. If you're excited for the video, be sure to leave a like to show your support and let's get straight into it. Now, if you're looking to get the elusive villager photos, the best way to get friendship with your villagers is to talk with them every single day and give them wrapped up presents. You can get the wrapping paper from Nook's Cranny, which honestly, I think a lot of people tend to ignore since this item doesn't have a whole ton of uses in the game, unlike some of the other things that are sold within the cabinet, but it is incredibly useful for getting friendship points with your villagers. These wrap presents help a lot, but one particular item has aided me extremely in getting villager photos. Since using it, I've gotten four villager photos, and I've played since March. I felt like I was incredibly unlucky even though I was giving out gifts to my villagers every single day and talking with them every day too, yet I got no photos. This item that's so good is the Iron Wall Lamp which gives the maximum amount of friendship points to any villager when gifted to them. What's great about this particular item is that they won't put it in their home so it won't mess with their decor at all. They also can't wear it obviously so you won't be destroying their wardrobe either which a lot of clothing gifts can do. Although there are many clothing gifts your villagers will like, I don't recommend this approach unless you want your villagers looking like this. I definitely have my regrets. Additionally, these are really easy to craft. They take two clay and free iron, so you won't be spending too much to make them. They'll of course also increase some of your Nook Mile goals for crafting, so that's even better. It's really a win-win situation when it comes to crafting these, even if it may take you a little bit of time. You can do it at your own pace of course and hand them out as you like, but I do recommend doing one per day. The three factors I listed plus the amount of friendship the iron wall lamp will give definitely helps get those villager photos. In all honesty, I couldn't recommend this more because it's definitely the best way in my experience to get those rare photos. As for what the photos do, not much honestly, but they do happen to be one of the rarest types of item in the game and it's a good way to commemorate your villagers within your house or even outdoors if you'd like. Who knows, you may even be able to get the elusive Bob's photo. I can tell you that I literally shouted when I got this one, and I think I'm going to have to make my own Bob shrine now. If you don't want to go through the effort of getting the photos, alternatively you can bring your villagers to Harvey's Island and get their posters via the Nook shopping app or in the Nook stop terminal, but these aren't as cool as the iconic photos in my opinion which are a lot harder to get and it kind of shows you've really worked for it. I didn't know about this personally before a user in my Discord brought it up, so I want to give a special shout out to him. His name is Mason, and you know, I want to give credit where credit is due, and I hope this video can help you guys as much as his advice helped me. If you want to continue the discussion, check us out on Discord, the link is in the description below. It's a really great place to connect with other Animal Crossing fans. I also want to give a big thanks to my channel members who help support this channel, a big shout out to them and you can click the join button down below the video or the link in the description to become a member yourself and get a whole bunch of cool perks. Thank you guys so much for watching this one, I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and you can also subscribe for even more Animal Crossing content. Be sure to check out my social media links in the description and also the two videos on the right side for more content as well.